Hey guys, it's Kelly. Welcome back to my channel. Today it is a Dollar Tree haul. It is February. I did not do a Dollar Tree haul in January because I took some time off from spending money. Saved up some money, paid some bills, and had to buy birthday presents for little Miss Adeline. She's turning seven in two days. So, but yeah. I got a bunch of Valentine's Day stuff, I got some birthday stuff, and I'm going to be showing you my little DIY Valentine's Day gifts that I'm going to be giving them. So, first bag, oh no, is got Valentine's Day stuff and St. Patrick's Day. I just lost a rose to one of my things, so hold on. This is a very seasonal haul. I love the beginning of the year because you got New Year's, you got Martin Luther King Jr. Day, you got my daughter's birthday at the beginning of February, you got my mom's birthday, you got Valentine's Day. You have all the holidays to look forward to and it makes some time go by so much faster. So that's why I like it. But the first two things I'm gonna show you are these roses with the hearts. I'm going to do a little bit of decorating on my bar because I don't really decorate for Valentine's Day and I want to get into that. So, yeah, I got these. I may put both of these in one vase and then go back and get two more because just having one looks like mm, bland, but having two looks like a bouquet. That's so much prettier. And I also got more of these little little hearts to stick in between. I don't know. I may play around with it. And then I may go back and get two, three more of these. Yeah. I don't know how I'm gonna do it yet, but I have a thing I have a picture in my mind of how I want it to look. Got the girls some candy, some Sour Patch Sweethearts. And bus is going by. So, one box for me and Sammy, Ari, and Abby. I had to buy some, well, this is not seasonal, but I had to buy some air fresheners. I got the vanilla, it comes straight in the pack. I put one in my closet. My closet is smelling a little. We have a problem in my master closet. That's all I'm going to say. And yeah, I'm not happy about it. What I'm going to put their uh, Valentine's Day gifts in are these little heart baskets. It came two in a pack, and then one basket's going to go in their bathroom for their bath bombs that they got for Christmas. So I'm going to put their candy in and their other gifts that I want to show you. I wanted a red, but they only have like one pack of red, and so they had a bunch of pink. So I just decided to get them all pink because I'm not dealing with all that. Got some socks for their Valentine's Day bucket. Got hearts, heart and arrow. These are so cute. And then my favorite are. The donuts and they love the socks that I get them from Dollar Tree they always wear them and they're always looking at them when we go into the store and stuff and then I got them new notebooks they love writing they love drawing they love writing down ideas and like doing like little paper games and writing games like tic-tac-toe and hangman and stuff like that so I got three yeah, you can't touch this with cactuses or cacti. And it opens like this. I don't say how many sheets are in there, but it's all right. I got the flamingo. Sammy will love this one, and I love the palm fronds. 
I really want to go back to the beach. I miss the beach. And then I got No Drama Llama. And I love this color in the stripes. And I got them three more item or one more item to put in their buckets and I got three of them. Um, I know they're too young for them. They're not going to be using them. They're going to be displayed on their shelves until they become older and move out and then they can burn them if they last that long. But I got them some candles. This one is Mermaid Dreams. Pink sand scented. And it smells so good and it's it's pretty purple. We got Pink Alicious. It is fun and flirty scented. Not really. It's a very pretty pink. I got Unicorn Magic, which is sugared marshmallow. And y'all know who's getting this one, Addie. That's it for the Valentine's Day stuff. I will be showing y'all how I do their little buckets. Probably later because I'm going to pick them up some more candy and stuff. I'm going back to the Dollar Tree tonight. And yeah. If I see something I like, I'm going to add it to the bucket and do that later and have it some little video. So subscribe for that. So I want to show you everything else, guys. I usually don't buy wrapping paper from the Dollar Tree because it's not enough, and I can't justify spending two, three dollars on two to three rolls of the same one and it not cover all my presents. I have three girls to buy for, and on their birthdays, I load them up with presents. But I'm hoping that these two will cover Addie's birthday presents. And she's got some big presents, so I'm hoping that I get at least two or three presents out of each roll, but if not, oh well. So, yeah. The first one I want to show you is this little circle overlay, overlap ones. It's really pretty. She's into these sorts of colors, like the pink and the purple and the hot pink and neon green so yeah and it goes it kind of matches it's got the same colors and this one caught my eye first this is not the one I was looking for I saw a what's new at Dollar Tree video have like a unicorn one and that kid is obsessed with unicorns if there was a Barbie one I would have snatched him up but I got this one. This matches one of her Barbie outfits, so she'll love it perfectly. The last two seasonal things, I only got two things for um, St. Patrick's Day, and these were these little daisies with the uh, gold coins stuck in the middle. I'm going to do the same thing like the uh, Valentine's Day roses in the hearts, but I'm going to get more. And they have the same stuff for St. Patrick's Day as they did last year, which is not, I'm not really a huge fan of, but I'm hoping that this Dollar Tree I'm going to tonight has some different things. And yeah, I just love these. I'm going to have to spray the little gold coins with glitter because it's a major fallout. Yeah, this is so cute. I love how it's all just bunched up in the middle and stuff last few items it's just this I got two I got I get these for our bathrooms I could probably get them cheaper at Walmart but I just don't go to Walmart that often to pick them up and when I go to the Dollar Tree I need them right then and there so and I can never find this scent at my Walmart I picked up a book one book the uh, book section at my local Dollar Tree is just awful I've cleaned them out. Yeah. This is the only one I've seen that I liked. That I'm interested in. And it's a nonfiction. And it's a movie. And it's 13 hours. The inside account of what really happened in Benghazi. 
by Mitchell Zukoff with the Annex Security Team. I like reading nonfiction books. Not many people can say that. I like nonfiction. I like learning about things. And the last two things I'm going to show you are two more candles. And this is a chakra candle. I got two because I only saw three. If there's more, comment down below. I think there would be more because you got seven chakras and I already saw three. So this one is for the throat. It's Balance and Awakening Soy Blend. And it smells clean. It's very pretty. It's got, I think that's from the uh, glitter thing. The, um, I think the glitter is from the St. Patrick's Day bouquet. But, oh well. And I like the label. And I think Casey would like these too because he's all into chakras and stuff. And then the last one I picked up was for the heart. Anahata Devotion and Compassion. That's a very pretty green. And yep, yeah, it's got the bouquet glitter in it, which is fine. And that's it. Be on the lookout for my Valentine's Day bucket DIY for my kids. Thank you for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed. If you did, please give it a thumbs up. Hit that subscribe button and hit that bell icon so you'll be notified whenever I post a new video, which is frequent. And also go down to my info box and follow me on my, all my social media. I am very active on my Goodreads and my Instagram. So come chat to me there. And I will see you in my next video. Bye.